fight went, it was the perfect strategy. He shouldn't have any respect for it. He walked him down with confidence, was touching him with punches. I think that the crowding the kicker strategy is a damn good one. And Sean Strickland put it on his Rod Asanya, and it worked masterfully. Crowding the kicker and checking everything Israel mm. through and really trying to make this a boxing match. And mm. Israel Adesanya is just not a boxer. When you have him backing up like that, the only shots he's got is that right hand that missed all night and that left hook that definitely missed all night. You know, he knocked out Rob Whitaker with that hook. He's cracked, you know, uh, uh, Paul Costa with that hook. Right. But if you don't run into it, if you time that hook, if you find that hook, Israel Adesanya doesn't have a lot more to offer. He has this like pullback right hand that was way too late all night. And Sean Strickland just beat him with a one-two, checking right. his shit, throwing some front kicks, walking him down, one-two down the pipe, Philly shell with the hands up. And what it what what Sean Strickland did better than anybody has done against Israel Adesanya is take away that cage. Israel Adesanya has great footwork. He does a lot of work by setting traps with his feet. If you can cut him off and walk him down like Pahea has done at moments and like Strickland did for 25 minutes, he showed you don't have to be the best boxer in the world. AJ. I loved watching you react to that knockdown because I felt the same way. Holy shit. When he was teeing off with those left hooks against the fence, it's something you never thought you'd see Sean Strickland do in a title fight against Izzy. It was insane. Masterful performance.